supercar stuff, you feel me? What's good YouTube, it's Supreme J here and today I am finally doing on the YouTube my new car reveal. So first, let's just go around the car and check it out. So you guys can see right here, we got, let me let this truck cross. We got a 2015 Shark Gray Stingray, all right. Take a look, take a look, and I'll go over all of the cool little features and whatnot in just a second. Alrighty, so let's get into it, okay? So, yeah, just take a look at the goddamn car, bro. The, the car is so freaking sexy, bro. Look at this thing. The color is amazing. So, check it. I got a 2LT, um, but this is not a Z51. So it comes, you know, it doesn't come with any like arrow kits or nothing on it and no past owner did that. So it has the standard grill with the chrome trim. Uh, you can see right there, the Corvette badge. And then one thing that I did have my boy Jose Raps do was he ceramic coated the whole hood and he added on the little, I believe it's called a stinger stripe. Um, I like it a lot. It's something very simple that just makes the car look a little bit more unique to me um and then once i get some of the paint touched up on the mirror um i'm probably gonna do the mirrors black as well uh taking a look at the wheels you can see right here some chrome wheels i'm not the biggest fan of the chrome wheels but i'm for sure gonna get some um nice wheels and then coming around we'll go over that in a second but yeah also no spoiler um but I'm definitely going to add a badass spoiler. Taking a look here, I added in a little Corvette license plate frame. And I have the active exhaust with the 4-inch tips, which I love a lot. And the rear end of the car is just absolutely amazing. Um, but let's hop in real quick to the driver's seat. The way it opens is sick. You see it says Corvette right there. Ah, uh, So yeah, so hopping into this mo um this car is freaking amazing guys um and i'm very and this is a no shade or nothing towards anyone that got a c6 or has one or you know told me to get one but i am very happy that i did not get a c6 because i honestly love all of the upgraded technology in the car i mean look how oh my god yeah the seats literally set you up to go in to how you want it format shut up shut up shut up shut up god damn it bro we gotta close the door Ugh. okay there so yeah so the, if you take a look right here it has a big freaking screen okay um you know it has for the bluetooth it has um you know info on oops it just went back all righty so you guys can see right there it has the screen and it has some dope stuff in it um So yeah, you can see right there, it has some very cool stuff. You can see I'm getting 18 miles per gallon, which isn't bad. Um, that one is in my trip, that's from like the past as well. V0, cause we're not even driving right now. Um, and I th yeah, I think the car has to be on all the way to show you guys all the stuff uh, in full detail. But I mean, it has a lot of stuff that it shows, which is really, really dope. You know, you could go over here and you could look at your performance. Um, you know, check your tire temperatures, your temp fluid, um, whatever else you want. Uh, let's go look at the phone. If we're on a phone call, we could peep that navigation, and then we have settings. Um, yeah, we could do the metrics, US, the PSI, all of that stuff, sport display theme or we could have it on track. Track looks a little bit too crazy for my liking. Um, but yeah, we can have it custom set to how we want it exactly. And that's touring. Touring looks a little bit whack to me. I'm gonna go ahead and keep it in sport. I think sport is the best looking one. Um, what else can we show you guys on this? So yeah, some pretty good features. It has navigation which you know i'm actually not too sure how to set up the whole navigation thing 
Um, maybe in the maps. I still gotta learn some things about this car, no cap. But yeah, so we have that, which is all cool and stuff. And the, you know, the steering wheel, it has a little thing right there. It has like a little Siri, the paddle shifters. Um, you can hold this and it presses the volume to go up. Um, this is for like the radio, I'm pretty sure. You know, just the mirrors and whatnot. We got the Bose speakers right here. I love the Bose speakers. Check this, you hold the button. And it sets it to how I love this, how I like the seat to be. You can see right there the mirror adjust. Coming into the infotainment section, you know, you could adjust the uh the all the little cool thingies on this. Doesn't have Apple CarPlay because it is not a 2016. This is a 2015. But as much as I love Apple CarPlay, um I just couldn't find a 2016 spec that I really liked and that met all of my other more pressing needs um yeah check that out that's some supercar stuff right there no cap so yeah we can put the screen up and down let me tell you guys why i wanted this as 2lt so bad one big reason the heated and cooling seats i love heated and cooling seats it's something that i really got used to but not only that it also has an extra bose speaker in here and the bose sounds amazing um the 2015 has like the updated um hello has the updated uh, little auto dim mirror whatever which is pretty cool and you know you could press that stuff right there i haven't messed with that though um and it has like the little garage opener um yeah you could take the top off which is pretty dope and one of the things that i really wanted to make sure i got was one spec with the transparent t-top and i mean just look at how insane that looks bro like it's normal and now it's through the top like look at that it's so dope dude it's like a massive sunroof it's way better than a sunroof in my opinion um it's something i absolutely love about this car um right here you flick this little knob and it goes into like uh toy mode track mode sport mode you can see the shifter right there. It has the Corvette logo with the eight speed. Um, another little cool thingamajigger. You flick that up, you got the little uh, cigarette lighter. You can have this up or down. I usually have a water bottle in here, so you know I have it up. Coming into here, we got the essentials, you know, some uh, air freshener, sanitizer, because we gotta stay sanitized. Putting that down. Um, so you, one thing though, uh, you can see in the passenger side, I have my old car mats from a Mustang on this one. I don't though, because the pedal is actually on the floor. Um, so I need to order some special Corvette ones for that. Got my little girlfriend right here. Let me just turn that off. And then coming to the back of the trunk, we got some stuff in there. Um, like the license plate frame and the front license plate the extra mat which i guess i don't really need back here um but it's just very light stuff and come like some little tarps i think they go in here to kind of block this uh the sun if you want them to which is cool um and then yeah the passenger side you know it has that dual climate control and stuff looks dope looks dope um let me see what else do i want to show you guys in the cockpit i mean one of the things that i love though is it's all centered towards the driver this is angled towards the driver um and yeah you just feel like you're in a freaking space jet a jet you know like that song says hopping in a jet um but yeah so peeps the seats though i got them in this nice gray and you can see right there that little corvette badge which is dope i love the way that the seats look the seats look so much nicer than my mustangs um and the way that they hug you and whatnot i love that they're not the most comfortable i will say that the mustangs were a little bit more comfortable but i mean it's a corvette okay you feel me yeah um and just take a look at like the view of like driving this car oh it also has the heads up display but i love look at how the fenders come up and then you see the hood right there you know the little stinger stripe that i got on you can't really tell um, just because it goes so well with the car and the high gloss and it's ceramic coated. Um, but yeah, you can see it a little bit. I mean, maybe you can see the paint difference. Yeah, you can see that right there. Um, but yeah, so we have all of that. 
and yeah the honestly the interior like i know it might sound funny don't get me wrong i absolutely love the exterior of this car but the interior is honestly just next level from the big old dash you know the way everything's set up you know to all of this oh yeah and this car is actually pretty damn good on gas i i bought this car from carmax in south sacramento and i literally got this car on a full tank and i drove back from south sacramento which is about an hour away i drove to and from um this place uh that's about 45 minutes away um so like 40 miles away so both round trip i went to another city near me um and then where else did i go i went some other places um and literally i barely hit like half the tank like with all of that driving that's like insane to me the mustang would have been absolutely dead straight up dead and i mean i put in 20 bucks and it literally went from i don't even know if you guys can kind of see it on the camera but it went from barely underneath half a tank to like the in between three quarters and full tank so that's like a whole quarter and a half which is really good in my opinion um but yeah i mean it, it might sound funny but all these things are things that you wouldn't expect to really like on a sports car but i freaking love them and i mean the steering wheel is so dope it's the, the you know the little corvette badge right there um so you know this is a 2015 so uh one of the things that it doesn't have besides apple carplay um it doesn't have the flat bottom steering wheel which is whatever but also you know the leather is a little bit more faded um but we'll take care of that soon enough but i absolutely love this car guys when i tell you guys that this is my dream car I'm not lying. I'm so happy that I got this car. And let me finish this video off real quick.